What up? This is Shizzle. What up? What up? So, uh, we're going to talk about uh, profoundly, in a really good way, about soccer, guys. But not soccer in general. I mean, why the New World Order? Why these people... Uh, when we see the news, for example, all the shit that is happening here in Italy, for example, they never miss to talk about soccer. How come? Why is so important soccer? And uh, with soccer, you can substitute it with your national uh, sport that you have where you live. So let's see why the psychological reasons why they promote this shit that is watched by millions of slaves now let me go here now because yesterday i'm not ashamed of saying it i was watching soccer in television it was just a stupid uh, match between some really low ranking teams uh, that that were not in the in the highest ranking good teams you know like here in Italy they have the A competition where the best teams are then there's the B competition and then there's the C so I was watching the C competition there's also D and whatever but uh, it, it's professional soccer and so I was seeing uh, when they were going because here's the 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 way things are done in soccer before playing this grown-up uh, slaves numbered marked and, and everything slaves they have to to go to the field they usually go one team you know lined 11 of them and uh, the other 11 lined up together and they go in the middle of the field and then they all lined up like soldiers and then they sing the the song of the state which enslaves them oh you beautiful uh, slavery uh, uh, my, my state enslaves me it's so beautiful uh, with with a hand in the heart uh, they, they really feel the, the, the slavery uh well they feel the fact that they get millions and, uh, and we're gonna talk about why they get millions also but since we are living in in a coliona virus a coliona is, is a moron, is a, a nuts. In Italy, we say coliona virus to make fun of this shit, you know. And so the, the they could not do the same things, you know, that we we could do in normal times. These are abnormal times. And so what they did, they just say to one team to go in the middle of the field. To line up and sing the songs <laughs> of the slavery and then after a few minutes that this team has gone then the the other one can go because this is for for uh for social distancing for, for for the for the for the virus guys then after after they all line up after you know taking care of this thing you know of making first the one the one team go and then the other team go because of the coronavirus <laughs> they should not stay together then just a few seconds later they all meet guys they shake hands with each other and all, almost uh, <laughs> kiss with a tongue with each other you know and uh, and 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 all this happens in front of these morons that that are, that are watching now this will be an analysis a psychological analysis on everything that i came up of why we have in my case that i live in italy soccer why is the psychological uh, reasons for soccer now playing is for little children grown up do not play especially if you're a fucking slave you should think on how to get out of this slavery but no there's morons uh but again th these are slaves like the rest of us you know that are put there that are given lots of money 
because money is what moves the sheeple, you know. And so by watching these billionaires uh, playing soccer or millionaires, whatever the fuck these monsters are, the sheeple watching can can see their beautiful lives. Oh, rich houses, rich uh, uh, cars and women they have. Oh, what a beautiful life they the rich people have. And so the slave should uh, aspire to do that kind of life. And But to get that kind of life that he will never get, <clears throat> to be rich like that, he will work like crazy. And be the the gear in the machine to make all this shit move, you know? The slavery move, to do things that he would not want to do. So, let me go ahead now and talk about these bitches. First of all, these morons... So, let, let's uh, see the psychological part of soccer, guys. Uh, we have these morons that... Of, of course, they use them for propaganda, but <clears throat> I will not talk about that, which in itself is uh, a reason enough, you know, to to shame these morons. But let's talk about the, the, the most obvious thing when you see grown-up men playing in shorts, playing. Children play, usually. In shorts, in front of many people. And they have to obey orders <clears throat> from two figures. First, their their coach, the guy you know that tells them how to play. You know, they don't have a mind of their own. Some someone else, the mind tells them what to do. He has the right to to take them out of the field, out of the game, and make them or put them in the game. This is the power, you know. Now, <clears throat> because... And then there is the referee, you know. That has the power to tell them, you know, to stop the game and whatever, you know. Because the reason for... for Especially for soccer guys, which is very, very uh, fouled here. Because... So, th these people are playing, okay. Who plays are the children. But now you can see the differences of children playing this game and this morons grown up in shorts playing this game. And you will see now where is, 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 the, is, is, the, is the venom here, guys. Why they, they do it like this. So when children play, there's no referee, guys. So there's no head telling them what to do. But here... Is the promoted play. This is not play. This is uh, just for programming, for propaganda. So the people watching are seeing these morons that are turned into little children by, by wearing shorts. By being marked as cattle. And by, by being told by someone more intelligent than them what to do. Which is the coach and then the referee. This turns them into pussies, guys. Because they they will would simulate getting, for example, because there's rules, you know. If the ball, for example, is touched and then goes outside the line, this imaginary line, they should stop the game. And and the team, you know, that uh, if one of the, the, the of the two teams touches the ball involuntarily. The other team gets to play the, the game. And what they do, these little children, they simulate. They watch at the referee and they tell, No, I didn't touch him. He touched him. Just like fucking little children. And this shit goes on uh, just in front of millions of people that maybe have watched that shit. And it, it, and it doesn't, ma doesn't, doesn't matter uh, who really touched the ball, you know. What matters is uh, if you were a son of a bitch enough, you know, to make, to fool the referee, to give it the ball, you know, to, to, to you. Even though 
even though millions of people have watched that in fact you are lying and so they are promoting also lying here with this match because lying is the glue you know of the, that runs this this shit just like as money you know lying also uh is a good part of the slave the, the, the slave should uh, should lie but the reason for for all this is is that when you when we are playing as children guys we do not do shit like this guys when the ball goes out guys or if it's if it's uh if if we touched for example in soccer if you touch it by hand the ball it, it's not good okay but if we did that as children because i used to play soccer when i was a child you know uh, and and also not as as, as so child <laughs> just not long ago at least 10 years ago well, maybe more uh so when when we play as children guys we would never do things like simulate or or for example you know who touched the ball for the last time so, so you get this uh, free kick or free whatever and we agree with each other when we are children that yes i touched it it's so obvious and get this guys the other guy knows very well for example when you are lying because he saw you he was just there and saw you touch the ball for the for the last for last you know and and it's shameful when you lie guys but these people have no shame this morons here and this guy here especially maradona which is seen as god here guys i mean people just write him like he is god you know for example uh when when they he he was Diego Armando Maradona, no? which is D. And then the number ten, and and they write it this D. Uh, this uh, D and ten like uh, Dio, Dio, uh, like it, it means God, you know. That's why you have die de deity, you know. Uh, Dio. But this guy simulated a very famous uh, goal in um, in the 80s i don't remember exactly with england i guess or whatever the team was you know he flied in the sky guys and and simulated like he was hitting the ball with the head but he touched it with a hand and he scored millions of people watched this clown touch the the the, the ball with a, with a hand and uh this was not volleyball you know you should not do that and yet even though you know i mean they, they have the, the the potentially they can very well say oh guys that doesn't matter i touch it with a hand it, it's it's not good especially because millions of people watched you uh do that shit you know but no they see the referee what the referee will decide if the referee said didn't see him that he touched it with a hand it's okay everything is okay so what this sport does yes is a glue for the morons watching you know to cheer on their nation you know which is unity for the slaves you know toward toward the same goal you know but turns them into pussies turns them turns turns them into pussies and uh and they do things like that little children and i mean it guys when we were children we would never dare for example because we would be ashamed of ourselves if we for example touch the ball by hand everybody everybody see see sees that uh well if, if you were children guys and we one of us touched the hand touched the hand uh, by uh touch the ball by uh, with a hand i mean if you dare to 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 think that you will get the goal even though you touched it with a hand you are just fooling yourself because nobody would let you do that but since we live with a mind someone that tells us orders he is the one who will decide who will win and that's why also uh with with that uh with the referee they have the, the the a way you know 
For example, how come Italy uh, after was fucked so hard in the Colonna virus? Uh, they they won the European uh, competition. Yeah, they gave them lots of uh, good things because you know just just to distract the, these morons from what they were for for the dick it was going in their ass. And and so what I mean is that the referee has the power to move this competition the way he wants. He, he has the power to to direct the match, you know, the way he wants, to give a a, a penalty or not, you know. So we we have this uh, this element, you know, of uh, and then now I will talk about the 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 people watching. Uh, but uh, uh, the last one, so they will simulate also when someone hits them or not, you know, and so they will fall, you know, and uh, again, things that uh, little children will be ashamed of doing, you know, because the other guy that contrasted you knows very well that it's not true, it, it's not true that he touched you and you fell, you know. And so it will be obvious that you are lying. And to lie, guys, it's, it's very shameful, so openly, you know. Not today anymore, because people are fucked up and lying is normal. But children would, would never do that, guys, because, because everybody would see that it would be obvious, you know. But when you put a mind, you know, the eye in the, of the pyramid, guys, the eye that sees all, that controls them, you are turned into a numbered marked moron that lines up there just like soldiers lined up that simulates f uh, a fall even though there's no fall you know so it turns you into soldier the coach the referee tells you what to do otherwise you are not uh, well just the fact that you are a grown-up playing that makes you a clown, uh, uh, little children, with shorts. Remember, with shorts. Uh, in Albania, guys, only children used to wear shorts. Grown up, do not wear shorts. I'm telling Albania, like when I was young, when people had the brain, guys. Uh, so this is the uh, the intention behind behind soccer in this case, but you can see it. Uh, that this pattern is repeated in many other sports uh, is very important for those that control us to promote this this individual that has you know th there's no individuality there guys also the scores guys Let, let's talk about also the 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 scores you know the fact that a team wins or not you know if uh, I've always uh, thought that the team that plays better for me is the one that won. The score for me is not important. But this is me. I'm a moron to think like this. Uh, what's important is, is the score. For example, I would be ashamed to win, uh, for example, a match that I didn't play well. I mean, everybody knows, for example, sometimes uh, a team wins with another team. But it didn't play well. Everybody knows that they sucked, you know. But yet, you know, they are glorified because they they won, you know. Maybe with the help of the referee that wanted that team to go to win. So this is the, the main thing. Turning. There's all these elements that they want to promote by, by, by people watching this shit. First, they are rich people. Rich clowns. Then they are used for propaganda. Everything will be fine, the moron tells in television to the sheeple that they were being fucked, getting, uh, losing their jobs and having uh, locked in the house because as I was fined, for example, for leaving 200 meters beyond the limit that I had. Because we, here in Italy, guys, we had to shop at our nearest shop. If you went 200 meters over, you will get fined. And I was fined because I was one kilometer like uh, uh, so, so much more than the 200 meters that they gave me they gave us 
and so the, the slave here is used for propaganda it tells the sheep everything will be fine you will just uh, be calmed in, in inside by the common 19 uh, by the seed of the serpent and, and everything will be fine and I remember when I did the series that I went in Rome uh, interviewing these morons and trying to, to, to wake up the sheep and I was dumb uh, they would tell to me, to me guys that oh let's hope this uh, V comes up so that he can, it can uh, save us and people are fucking morons guys uh, so so yes they are used for propaganda and it's a very important uh, you know I don't say fag because it only serves to hurt and oppress gay man here is for uh, the, the usual you know uh, the Jews and everything you know uh, respect the diversity you know here it is the, all this stuff is uh oh global action for climate change you know we joined you know sports sports for for climate action uh don't go outside says uh, this soccer player here very famous soccer player i stay home says here uh let's score against coliona virus uh, what do they have here? Football versus uh, homophobia. Football for every, everyone. So just, just this enough, you know, would, would make you just uh, uh, just vomitate, you know. This thing here is kicks off. And again, the fact that they are uh, they, they they are given lots of money because uh, this way the slaves can uh, can have this objective of being rich, you know. And then they are used, you know, to fuck people in poor countries to, to give us uh, less and less and, uh, and and poison us and whatnot with this organization. They can they are clowns like this, you know. We stand for change. Yes, change will come. It, 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 it will not be uh, for that uh, for the change that we would. Uh... So here we have the morons here, guys. Uh, not a racism. Uh, for George Floyd, justice for George Floyd. Stop violence against women. They want to get rid of men, you know. The the the. Uh, they are turning men into pussies and pussies into and women into into bitches because they want to they want these bitches to 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 just have fun not not make children anymore look look at look at the morons guys just, no i didn't touch the ball no no what are you saying referee shut up says the referee you know it's, it's the head you know <coughs> I got the coronavirus, guys. Uh, so they're saying here the the International Day for Against Violence Against Women. You know, uh, just put a lipstick in in your in your dumb clown face. So you soccer players and their soccer players putting that shit there and uh, taking pictures with their whore girlfriend. And playing like this, they played actually played like this, guys. These clowns. They give them lots of money to to, so that they are able to to make them do whatever they want. And here's the referee. No, I'm telling you. I mean, can you understand, guys? You you would not need a referee, guys, if we were. Well, first of all, if you are a grown up playing soccer while you are a slave you know you you are you are mentally ill mentally ill guys and if you are not liking what i'm saying right now you are a moron as well you are mentally ill as well you are a fucking slave and you enjoy to watch this shit i'm not talking about enjoying watching this shit guys let's talk about the people watching i mean who would who would watch you guys, guys in slavery you know there's let's go to some uh, 
they're stuck here's uh, the the guy is getting the, the magic juice and he's showing a uh, picture now if you are a slave guys and they say to you you, you gotta you gotta go and see these morons play in the stadium you know I mean who would it's like little children guys instead of playing go to watch other children play and they would enjoy it I mean just a fucking slave would do such a thing guys because with the life that they have they are unable to do the same thing and they want to be part in this in this uh, theater you know in this uh, spectacle you know and they want to see these uh, rich, rich people playing you know ah, it gives them ah oh, so beautiful oh, oh. I'm a, like they they want to see things that they cannot do you know but they want to uh, they would like to do but they cannot do anymore because deep inside them since they are turning to little children they would like to play like that but but they will not do it guys if nobody's watching them you know there's this spectacle uh, aspect to it so what is the reason for for the millions of morons there in the stadium watching well thousands of morons watching is to give importance to this dumb marked grown up mentally ill morons clowns like this one here playing otherwise this shit that they are promoting you know to put marked morons that take orders from a referee and from their coach that simulates uh, a fall just to so to promote a soldier mentality and the and the immature mentality to the morons watching yeah be like this be like this lie be marked with a number uh, 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 take orders from someone telling even though you are a grown up someone someone else tells you what to do because you are not un unable to and you should obey him he knows well how to kick a fucking ball in the in the net there you are unable to do that so the importance of all to promote this bullshit it, it, they want to highlight it they want to give it more importance if lots of people are watching this bullshit guys and again they have the power to make even the most stupid thing look cool just by putting it in television and just by putting millions of, of morons watching that shit we can have in, in the news for example here in Italy yes it's beautiful you see they, they go from the war that they have created and everything or from telling you that uh, you are a slave we, we will begin rationing now that uh, unfortunately because uh, Putin is, is very very porn porn is very very dangerous man and he is, is very evil and 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 there's a potentiality for this war that can erase all humanity they go from that you know and from the fact that you have no job anymore and then everything unfortunately you are things are getting tougher and they go to talk about soccer and the morons watch it guys they have no fucking shame to do this they they, they take like 10 minutes of the news talking about this bullshit here guys because it's very important to promote this bullshit guys this soldier mentality you know these marked morons all lined up there like soldiers singing the hymn of the state which here in italy is a masonic hymn yes everybody knows it fratelli 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 fraternity fraternity of a brothers brotherhood of italy Fratelli d'Italia, brother. It's a Mason's case. <laughs> it's very obvious. <laughs> the guy that unified Italy was a Mason. And and uh, one of these Masons that you might know is Mazzini, guys. If you watch uh, Bill Cooper, guys, he ha has mentioned 
Mazzini many times because it's like your uh, Albert Pike, the same level of uh, of bestiality, of importance of these freaks. So this is the reason uh, for sports, guys. To promote these aspects of uh, that uh, that uh, you know really really is useful for them at the top to promote, which is this concept of the B. You know, the, the B works. You know, as just a number. You know, and these morons are all numbered there. And. Uh, <clears throat> but I guess I said it all, you know, guys. Let's take another look at these clowns, guys, and uh, and stop this shit. Look at these clowns in shorts, guys. Smiling, you know, they, they also have the nerve to smile, guys. These fucking slaves will be will be, will be slaughter. That like the rest of us, but they 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 are mentally ill, guys. Someone that is mentally ill. That knows because everybody sees where the fuck we are going, guys. And yes, and and yet for money he goes along with that shit. These are mentally ill guys, and everybody that today acts like everything is normal is mentally ill, guys. It's called uh, has a, has also a name in uh, the science has given this uh, thing a name, uh, Stockholm syndrome. Look at the moron, guys. He's like f 40 years old, in shorts there, he's smiling. He's giving orders to, to other grown-ups. Mm. Not a racism. Yeah, I'm a slave. They tell me, you know, to, to take the magic juice and I take it in front of people. Uh, these are famous soccer players, guys. All uniting, you know. And this is the the mentality here, you know, uniting. The bowl unites these morons that would be, you know, just free and individuals, but no, it unites them into one. It's the team against hunger, guys. I mean, these are the people that create hunger. It says here, football against hunger, against climate. UNICEF that kills little children and they promote it guys they are they are these are mentally ill guys this is this is the, the the time where mentally ill people guys are promoted as heroes mentally ill people are promoted as heroes and are given lots of money mental these people are mentally ill no heal <laughs> ill only a only a zombie would do something like this, guys. Only a fucking zombie. And, and because they are zombies, they are promoted. Here's the globe for you guys. And with that, I gave you why the New World Order promotes soccer not like nobody analyzed it before. Okay? Now go to your fucking truthers and, and see the, 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 the other bullshit that he tells you. And never analyzes things like this. Deeper like this. And go and fuck yourself and unsubscribe bulls. Okay? Uh, your, your, your beautiful uh, truther doesn't tell you this. But I tell you. Because I'm free. I owe you nothing. I, I do things in English if I want, in Italian if I want. You, you don't have to ask me, oh, why are you making it in Italian? No. I do what the, whatever the fuck I want. Otherwise, I would be like this pussies here. Someone tells me what to do.